Hello, and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. I am the Ixalan. And last time we unlocked this SMB Superfan Challenge. We got a win streak of two and 18 Eden tokens. Let's do an Eden run. Feeling kinda... Ooh, ooh, what is, what is, what just happened? Okay, PhD, started with a pill, speed up. That was pretty good. That's gonna be really great. Okay, what's our seed? J seven N Y F A T P. I'm with PhD, a, a tarot card, and Krampus's head. Krampus's head is really good item to start with. It's got a well to start with. Not, it's, I don't, I don't actually think it's that great of an item. I think when Rebirth first came out, it had like a two or three. Room, I think it had a three room recharge, and it was just stupidly good. Now at six rooms, it's it's solid, but it's not like one of the best items because its versatility is basically just for bosses like right here like yeah it wrecks famine without a doubt obviously it just did and I think it's really good for boss fights but it, that's pretty much its only versatility in my opinion obviously your miles might differ what was our what is our actual item here pay to play huh magic fingers I think I'd rather take the head of Krampus because I want to keep our money to either donate to the machine or serve us some other better purpose. And if I was looking at our at our loading screen, I think we got to take Eden here to Isaac is I think our our active goal. This room sucks and serves us no point. No point, no purpose. Give me a consumable. All right. Well, that almost makes it worthwhile. And now we have protection for our hopeful devil deals on the next floor, which is really good. Oh, this is this is a good start. I I played my casual file a little while ago because I haven't I haven't played Isaac in a few days. Actually, I think it's close to about a week now. Uh, the Steam Summer Sale has ended, and as most people that use Steam, I'm sure spent more money than I wanted to. <laughs> uh, got a few games, and so I've been playing some other games. So I haven't really been playing Isaac very much. I felt very rusty, and I was playing on hard mode, and I basically got decimated. I was not satisfied with my overall performance, so this is it's a bit of a change. It is nicer, which is weird because I think I don't think there's a huge difference between normal and hard mode. The main difference, from my understanding, is the, the amount of consumables that drop. This guy, like our damage is not very. It's not bad. But it's not very good either. Yeah, we're taking way too long to kill these guys, and I just want to kill Sloth. He's not even going to give me anything, he's just a tarot card. Okay, well, we're almost guaranteed a devil deal unless we really botch it on this floor. So, I think I'm going to save that devil deal for the first devil deal that we want that we don't get access to. I think is a safe way to put it. I do want to go into that curse room after our devil deal. Mom's bra. We're getting really screwed here. No passive items, all active items, and you can only carry one means we haven't really gotten a good, like, solid upgrade on this run so far. Granted, you know, our first floor gave us a cube of meat, and that's decent. I wouldn't say it's anything, like, super fancy. Oh, especially when I do crap like that. I was trying to use it to, like, block these guys, but obviously it did not work the way I wanted it to. So that's just kind of the really bad play that I was talking about from my practice rounds. Okay, boss fight. Uh, and Crypt is just in time for that, so... Get wrecked, monstro. <laughs> I don't have time for your crap. Uh, let's go in here, see what we got. Ooh, Guppy's Paw. Guppy's Paw is definitely what we're gonna take. Uh, I will... We're at two red hearts, so I'll eat a red heart. Oh, we know what all of these are, and they're all good. Well, we got two health ups, so it totally worked out in the end for us. Uh, we're going to keep Joker with us. It's obviously a way better card. But we have some ability. We're going to get some more health here. And I think we still have soul hearts, so I'm... Okay, that didn't really help me. Would give me a chance to get my Krampus head back if I wanted it, but I do not. Lemon party. Balls of steel. There we go. That made coming in here worthwhile. Are there any red hearts anywhere that we can get? Nope. No bombs, it looks like. Alright. 
We are out of here. Not a very, like, damage-wise super strong run. We should shoot this poop, actually. Just gonna get out of here, but... I wanna play. We don't have a... What are the things called? Trinket. That's the word. We do not have a trinket, so petrified poop would be pretty solid for us. So may as well break these in the off chance that we get something. We did not. But it was worth checking. Right, we want to keep the Joker card. So we have three red hearts now? And like, all of the soul hearts? Two red- oh. Did I? Oh, because I gave up one red heart for, for the paw. Duh. Basic math, man. Yeah, you guys would think I would be able to do that since it's my job, but nope. Not today, apparently. Basic math is not possible for me to do when it's my day off. <laughs> Alright, so we got two health up pillows, which was really nice. If I we had PhD, I was all worried about, like, mom's pills being potentially dangerous, but... No, they're all... Okay, can I... Yeah, I want this. Get in here. Get in here. I'm gonna take the lemon party pill in here. Open this. Just get these guys killed quickly as possible. Get these guys killed super fast. And the maws would be immune to lemon party. So that actually worked out really well. We managed to take all of the tard bros out super fast. And they're the dangerous ones. So we have, uh, we have a little versatility. Not not super strong for a run, but versatility, which is always good. And now we can save this bomb for whatever comes up. Probably not a tinted rock is my first thought. Maybe a secret room? I'd like to get into a secret room. We haven't been in one of those yet this run. Get out of here. Uh, what else could a bomb do for us? Maybe access something that we really need. Some chests, some nickel, like a nickel and a, an extra money. We're totally gonna go in here. Put these fires out for us. Get us spiders. All right, whatever. Oh, we could have gotten these guys too. See, this is why you wait. I say that every time, and yet I never wait. I always just like, oh. And then sometimes the game just forgives you for your mistakes. Thank you. Speed up, I'm on board with that, that seems pretty good. Okay, these guys are kind of a pain in the butt. They shoot a lot of tears and they charge me. I was very lucky to take out that first one with our orbital. Kamikaze, man. If I had Pyromaniac, I'd be all up in your grill. But you're super dangerous. So we're just gonna pass on you. Appreciate the sentiment and the offer on coming in here. Love being able to take out slow moving enemies with a cube of meat. I figured that was there, but just gotta double check. If we got seven cents, would I want to go into the shop is the question here. Because there could be something on sale, but we don't need a soul heart really. And I think it just makes more sense to save up money to 15 to get a decent item. Maybe, maybe that's crazy talk, but. I feel like that's probably our best bet. If I was gonna guess for a super secret room, I would guess here. Oh, nice. Okay. Oh man, if there was a freaking arcade or temperance machine, we'd be set. Okay. Chubb here is gonna be our slight problem. Maybe we can just. Can we trick him into doing this? Because we are faster. These speed ups have helped. Oh, that was that was my bad. Let's get him running. Come on, come at me. Come at me. Oh, get in there with the cube. Oh, I'm stuck in the corner. Oh, we got him. Okay. That cost us more hearts than I would have liked. I'll take a health up. And then let's joker, because that was the whole point. Oh, oh, oh. Two thirds of the way to Guppy. That's how we're going to win this one. Without significant damage bonuses, we're going to have to get Guppy. Well, we don't ha I guess we don't have to get Guppy, but it's going to help a lot. <laughs> Getting that third piece of Guppy will be very nice. Oh, uh, we could we could eat to get in there. The Guppy's paw can get us can turn our red hearts in and let us get into that. But 
I really don't think that's worth it. That was really dumb damage. I didn't expect him to curve like that. It's just... Touch him with the cube of meat, and wow, they're dumb enough to walk into fire. That's a whole... That's a whole thing I was not expecting. Alright, let's go in here. My buddies. I like that. Got us a lot of health back. I started to say, like, my something, and it was just like, I don't know what I'm saying, so just make a word and go. Uh, I think Lemon Party, what is this? Yeah, Lemon Party is better than the Empress. Our damage isn't good enough that a, a damage multiplier would make a significant difference. Uh, well. <laughs> well, yes. This is way better. This gives us a lot of versatility here. So what we can do is now we can go and kill most of these things with our cube of meat. Okay, that was really just bad on our part. Should have realized the meat, was, the cube was not gonna spin around in time. But for the most part, that's really effective. Get in here. Oh, get wrecked! Bam. And that is what the unicorn stump does. It's so good. Okay. So we put a bomb here. Oh yeah, okay, put a bomb here. So two bombs gets this whole place. I like that. What is this, range up? I'm on board with that. I'm in party. Let's get that done. <laughs> I didn't really need the cube of meat, that, or not cube of meat. Let him party that, but I kind of felt like it. It sounded like a good idea. Okay, I'm just gonna use the cube of meat for these guys, because they're kind of scary. Okay, now I got my tears back. That guy's down. Overall, this is a this is a pretty solid synergy between these two items. I'm very happy with how this is turning out. Did we miss the shop yet? No. Okay. Ooh, I kind of want that, but we don't have like mom's key, so it's not like those are significantly better than anything. Mom's key's in here. Oh, oh there's options. It's really good. We got, only got to donate one penny this time? I didn't, act, I actually didn't actually mean to donate it, but... I mean, sure, I guess. You wanna be a butt about it? Okay. Perfect. Oh, come on! You're a jerk. I feel like the secret room should be here, too. Boom. Got it. Nailed it. Blow you up. Key. Bomb for a key is actually perfectly acceptable in my world. Okay, let's fight this guy. You wanna do this? I think once he splits and, and starts charging us, then we use the horn. And then we fart on him. Those are the two things we're gonna do. Get in there. Oh, you were not supposed to hit me that way. But that's okay. The Fallen is really good because we can get a devil deal. And if we can get a devil deal on the next floor as a result. Cube of meet him. Yes. Oh, very nice. I honestly think, um, I think the creep is better than Sister Maggie. I'm, I'm a bigger fan of Headless Baby. Oh, you thought you were gonna get away from this, huh? You thought you were gonna get away? You ain't got nothing. Since we already had Krampus head, I think he was guaranteed to drop a lump of coal. Not 100% sure, but I think that's how that works. If you guys know for sure, please correct me. I'm pretty sure that's the correct case. See, so yeah, I think we got this thing on lockdown. Let's go in here. Ooh, a library. I think I kind of like invincibility more. Let's see how I feel about this as we go forward. Maybe I'll change my mind. If we can get some form of uh, flight or teleportation, we can totally do the curse room for completely free. Ooh. Callus is an awesome trinket. I definitely have to kill these guys this way. I got a bomb here, right? Yeah. Give me my soul heart. Lemon party is a solid pill. This is absolute garbage. We're just gonna use it here. Hey, hey! That was really lucky. Honestly, did not expect that to work. But I think like it's always worth using. Uh, was that my best friend? That's my best friend, right? Yeah, the the doll of yourself. I can I was forgetting if my best friend was the like subtext title for scapegoat. But I don't think it is. I think it's something else. So the creep here is actually, yeah, helping out a little for us. Get this guy dead. 
There we go. Beautiful. That worked. Oh, we don't have a key to get into the shop, though. Okay, we need to get a key. Gotta pay attention to consumables here. This little dude. Stay red, bro. Stay red. Yeah, beautiful. Okay, take out these fires, because I feel like I might come back here when I have the key, and I don't want to accidentally get shot. Oh, this... This room is easy. We don't need to use our invincibility here. Avoid death. <laughs> I say as I, like, almost get hit there and start to panic. Easy rooms like this, I'm all about. This is so nice for us. Okay. Fat guys don't jump. The runs bleeding out of their eyes. Those jump. So those are the ones you have to focus fire on first. <sighs> yeah... I mean, if I find a room full of spikes, get in here, get in here, this is very important. Can I kill you guys with these? Yeah, beautiful. Okay, this guy's going to be a butt. There we go. Oh, that worked out so well. I am actually mildly afraid that the boss will be flying and my lemon party won't be very helpful against it. So I'm going to try to get a charge on the Book of Shadows before we go in. Hello, friend. I will play the hell out of you if I can't get a key. Come at me. That guy's trapped on my creep, and it killed him, and I almost walked on the spikes. Callus would be very good here. What is this? Death. Okay, I'm on board. Oh, that was super dumb. Don't get off the spikes. What are you doing? Oh, what am I doing? I tried to get in between the rocks. This... Oh, God. Dang. <laughs> Oh, that was painful. Okay, we've been to the secret room. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take Lemon Party. Is the correct play, I believe. And we're going to go into here, grab a fully charged unicorn stump, spend half a heart going in here. This is why we didn't use the bomb. It's very important. Get two more, beautiful, and then get out, invincibly. So we still don't have, oh, still don't have a key though. So the shop might just be dead to us. We're gonna have to accept that as a possibility, which is perfectly fine. Let's see who our boss fight is. I do like the flat coin, Gish. This is so easy, it's not even funny. Come on. You're like dead. Do you not even know you're dead? You're so dead. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Gish. Little Gish has appeared in the basement. Uh, I will take matchbook up to get bombs. And a soul heart. Little Gish is, is a pretty good follower. Uh, some would say that he's probably better than the matchbooks. Eh, that's debatable. I'm gonna play this guy, try to get a key, maybe. A key or a payout. Give me that. Alright, that's good enough. We'll take the death card with us. We do have this key. We will go into the shop. Probably could have done all of this before we fought the boss. Might have given us more info. Oh, nope. This all would have been... Let's just death card that. That probably actually makes a lot more sense. Oh, and he's dead. Okay. And now we should have, like, a good amount of keys. Or three. Which is not a terrible amount of keys. It could absolutely be worse. Could be better. Could be worse. There's no tarot cards. There's nothing else that we need. So I... Th oh, with this guy. Forgot. We have more money. We need to play this guy. He needs to pay us out. Yo, pay me. Pay me or something. Health up is acceptable. I appreciate it. That cost us, what, like five cents? For health upgrade? That's real good. Oh... Okay, so this is the mom floor. We should get a devil deal on this one, I think. Let's get in here. Let's try and get that blood bag if possible. IV bag, huh? We'll play this a couple times. Try to get some keys going. All right, so we're up to eight keys. That's pretty solid. We should be able to open all the doors and chests that we want from here out. I wouldn't be super concerned. Go around these spikes carefully. 
And so, obviously our primary objectives are the item room and the shop. Let's get out of here. Uh, what are the odds? Is there a place? No, okay. Oh, it could be there. That was crazy. <gasps> Raw liver! 2 HP up and full health. That is such a good item. And it only appears in secret rooms. And we got the bomb in here for free. And now we can bomb this way, because I don't want to go out that way. Oh yeah, we should totally kill these guys with the cube of meat. Because lasers are not my friend. Yeah, so if we have like an issue where we're like suddenly going, hey, you know what would be really cool is if we had a ton of money. I can't tell what creep is mine and what creep is theirs, so I'm just gonna hide here. Okay. <laughs> That was really scary for me. <laughs> so yeah, if we need money, we have access to money with the IV bag. Which will get us out. And if we need keys, we also have access to money via keys. It's a little convoluted to get them out of the flat penny. Is that what it is? The flat penny? I think that's what it's called. Yeah, because then there's the burnt penny for the bomb one. I feel like I said it earlier and then somehow it just like brain farted out of out of my mind what that trick was called. Come on, guppy. Oh, you always gotta you always gotta hope. Lemon party. Luck up. Luck up is really good. That increases the number of consumables and drops that we get. Okay, so we just gotta avoid these things. There's gonna be two. Three. That's bad, because we don't have a whole lot of damage here. Okay. Oh, there's four. This is super awesome. Holy cow, that scared the crap out of me. I didn't think we were gonna make it out of there safely. Let's go get in here and kill these guys. Excuse me, hello. I, I am here to kill with the killing, please. Thank you. Beautiful. Oh, holy mantle. Okay, so we're just like in tank mode, basically. So much health, holy mantle. I will buy all of these things because I can. You buy this one first, gives you three cents, and you buy champion's belt. So you have to buy it in a correct order, I guess. But that one was kind of a no-brainer. And we bought the piggy bank uh, mainly because it's we could, and we had like we don't have money as power, so there's no specific need to hold on to money. But also because if we get the ability to like reroll our run into something different. I probably will do it, and the piggy bank is another item that we'll be able to reroll. Plus, I mean, we're just getting more money back, so why worry? All right. Oh, we're like just a minute or two late for boss rush. If we had more damage, like if we had gotten any kind of like damage upgrades on this particular run. Okay. There goes my holy mantle shield, which is fine. We can get in this guy. Yeah, but if we had had damage on this run, in addition to our just raw survivability with tankiness, we probably would have been able to make boss rush and gotten another task down. I think we can spend two keys for stupid amounts of bombs. That's a pretty good, pretty good trade in my book. And we found the boss room, which is pretty solid. Oh, there goes my invincibility, but that's fine. Oh man, that this is why Holy Mantle is so good. It's that that raw invincibility. We're gonna check for super secret room. Here and here. Uh, here as well. Okay, good. An eternal heart. I mean, why not? Like, let's have all of the red hearts in the game. I don't see a reason why you wouldn't. Put this down, space bar, get him in there with the cube of meat. Get in there with the cube of meat. I forgot that we could still we can still be shooting while we have this open. I was I've forgotten that whole process. This just makes my life so much easier. Okay, let's uh, let's try to keep our holy mantle if possible. And I'm assuming we're gonna lose it to the foot. Is kind of my understanding. But nope, we just lost it there. Okay, so we didn't lose it to the foot. We lost some random mob. It's not the end of the world. And there goes some money. Oh. Piggy Bank gives us more money when we get hit. I forgot about that. I literally just bought it so that it was it was an item that gave us the three cents we needed. <laughs> I forgot what its actual core function in this game was. So really, it produces us keys when we get hit. If you want to think about it like that. 
Oh, I came on the wrong side. Phrasing. <laughs> I was supposed to attack away from the other side. I'm really bad with the orbital. I gotta get better about that. Can I get in here? Can I hit you with this orbital? You wanna pop your eye open? No? Okay. Yeah, now you're dead. Boom. Alright, let's go to Isaac. And there it is. There is the thing that we want. More than anything, we are guppy. What is this? Bad gas? What is this? Health up. You know what? We'll take this. And then we'll take this. And we'll get this. And adios! We are the guppy! The cat of doom! We've, we've basically won this. Like, our health is in pretty good shape. Our tears don't do all that much damage, if we're being completely honest, but... We have a decent fire rate. There's gonna be more hands. And we make so many flies. And we now we have the Empress. So now that we are Guppy, the Empress will actually be beneficial. Oh, that's right, we have a little Brimstone. Forget about him. We bought him because we need to practice with him. There we go, that was a good shot with a little Brimstone. That is not worth it. I actually don't know what, the, what it could possibly be that would have been worth it. We just gotta remember to like stop shooting every second or two. If we do that, a little brimstone will fire. Cause I'm so used to just like moving the keys around without letting them up so that we never stop firing. But that's too far, no, no not too far, perfect. Like this, to get out of my way. Bad gas or Empress? Empress was obviously the correct answer, that's why I went with it the first time. Don't second guess yourself, Ixalan, what are you doing? Oh, left hand. That's really tempting. That is really tempting. The reason it's so tempting is all of the red chests have... I mean, yeah, could, they could spawn spiders. But in the grand scheme of things... Here, let's... Oh, walking into him hurt? That was stupid. Get this out of my face. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, nice. Nice shot, little broomstone. I completely forgot where I was going and why I left- oh, so left hand would be good because all of the red chests that we would get ha would have a chance of spawning either soul hearts or pills, and we know all of our pills are good because we have PhD. So only when it spawns like spiders and troll bombs would it actually be bad, which touche is, is a big concern, like I'm not gonna sugarcoat it and say that's not the case. I didn't see if there was a tinted rock, but I figured rather than trying to check during the laser beams, Hagalaz was the correct answer here. I feel like this is definitely where we're going. Yes. So I'm going to go back and get that uh, Empress card. Empress card, come with me. Come with me and you'll see all the cool stuff we can do. Oh my god, wow, I've never seen this room before. This is probably like not even that rare of a room. So it's kind of weird that I haven't seen it, but you know what? I'm okay with that. Mr. Fred, huh? All right, let's kill your minions. Oh, your Fred, your Fred Juniors need to die. Okay, this guy's dead. And then we'll just stand here and fire a little brimstone every now and then. This should be pretty easy, I would think. We go in there, we get some flies. We back away from this tier, we summon some flies. Okay, we did not get what we wanted, but I'm going to take Screw, because it's tears up. So now we'll fire more and make more flies faster. I didn't even need the invincibility in there. There's so much invincibility. We're just, we're just so tanky. Okay, this is an actual dingle. Did not... For some reason I thought it was the other version. I was not really paying very, very much attention. So that was on me. I love that when the champions break, they break into, like, non-champion versions. I'll get a health up. I ain't afraid of no health up. What you can do to me, game? Give me more health? Sure. Spend all my red hearts, activate the Polaroid. Ooh. <laughs> hey. So about what I just said, and there being an arcade here. Hmm. Mm, how do I feel about this? Use this, go. I kind of want the blood bag, which is my primary purpose for doing this. There we go! Oh, so good. So, so good. Okay, 16 keys is definitely more than enough. I realize that we have the Polaroid. I'd forgotten that we unlocked the Polaroid. Obviously, I knew that we had it since we got it 
at mom's thing. I just was talking about other things. But the Polaroid is gonna let us get to the chest. So our first chest run might actually be an Eden run. And it's looking like it's gonna be a pretty sweet victory on our side. Cause I mean, we got, we got Guppy, we got a bunch of keys. Little Brimstone is actually kinda helping out a little, it looks like. All right, let's take a moment, look over here for Tinted Rocks. I'm not seeing any. I don't even see any that are the correct shape, I should say. Which is kind of a prerequisite to having the correct one. Brimstone that guy. And dead. Yes. Left? Left is not the right way. Psst. I always thought I was going to be so happy. I was like, left is totally the right way. See? This is why I go left. Nope. Nope. I will go back for that key. Get rid of that. That. Guess we're going up. Up is not the correct way. This is like a trap. Well, I, it's gotta be this way. This is like the only viable solution. Yes, excellent. Oh, so good. Did I leave a key back? Oh, let's go get it. Not that I expect that we're gonna hit 20 chests on the chest, but it would be super sweet if we did. I should probably just get in here, is my thought. Come down. And then I'm just gonna circle around you with this. And I think I lost my invincibility, so now I'll just laser beam you. And flies, and laser beam. And flies. And I got hit once. But I dodged into that. That one was my fault. Can't even believe the game. I'm not picking up that penny. Because I had already walked into the light when I saw it. <laughs> we are doing very well. I think this Empress card is going to be used on Isaac just to make sure that we get past him pretty easily. Right, little brimstone. This is my little brimstone training session. At least he has, like, the brimstone pierce is, like, hard counter fistula. Just get out of my face, fistula. You got nothing on me. No key? Okay. Game has decided that it does not want to give me keys anymore. Except for that golden key. And the beautiful thing about... Holy Mantle there is it let us get out of the curse room for free. There we go. Beautiful. More money? You want to give me money as power now? Now we can talk. I'm on board with that. Thought I, would, I thought I would get back and hit that one in time. I did not. One down, two down. Beautiful. This is, this is going pretty well. All in all, I am very happy with how all of this run has turned out compared to how my practice run that you guys didn't see because I didn't record it because it's my casual file went. I like to like warm up, you know? If you haven't played Isaac in a couple days, you want to make sure your reflexes are, are active. I've had a couple times where like I didn't sleep very well, so I tried to play Isaac and my reflexes were just like really slow and I was off point on everything and I was like, this is really dangerous. I should not be doing what I'm doing here. And then I died. And I was like, alright, well that's a reason not to record. Oh. Right? Like, why not? Why not take the Eternal Heart? I can't think of a reason. Crawl space. Oh, crawl space better. <gasps> Black market! Cause you're not overpowered enough, we have to give you everything. Hey! The habit. And another red heart. Boom. I'm not gonna buy any of this other stuff, because that doesn't matter. And I could- I think I could skip Isaac? Yo, can I straight up skip Isaac? Does this take me straight to the chest? <gasps> Suck it, Isaac! Mm, 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 mm. That's the best news that's ever happened. And the wafer? Okay. Like, thunder thighs, sure. Why not? Like... Oh yeah, we, we got our holy mantle got lost. Oh my god, that's this is insane. Okay, I should probably kill these guys like really fast. It seems pretty dangerous. All things from what I from what I understand. Okay, this guy needs to die like ASAP. Is he dead yet? No. Okay, now he's dead. Now we just got this one to deal with. Okay, and we lost our holy mantle shield. Back up, laser him. Oh nice, didn't take any damage. Alright, I don't want to jinx anything, 
But if you guys know what's going on, I'll be very... Oh! I, I jinxed it as soon as I said it. As soon as I said anything. Oh, man. This sucks. <laughs> I Because we didn't take any damage on... At least I don't think we took any damage. On the previous floor. Because we skipped Isaac. I was really hoping we would be able to just get to the... Get to Blue Baby and not take any damage. And unlock Samson via the chest. And I was like, that would be super cool. Probably could have happened if I had brought... Whatchamacallit? The... The Unicorn Stump? That's the word I was looking for. If we brought that instead of the shadows, we would have had invincibility in every room. I think that would have been a significant contributor. There's no poop. <laughs> I was like, oh, finally, we got the poop thing. There's no poop. There's just no poop. Like, there's no poop on this. Okay, well, let's get to you guys hard countered. Try to get this guy dead? No? Okay, you need to be dead. I feel like we should, s even though he's not the last one that we killed, I think we still get the, the soul heart because he was a boss in the room. Is that not correct? No, it's not. Okay. Well, this is good to know. We've learned new things about how champions and their force drop rates are. Don't get hit by that. But yeah, we're, I mean, we're literally unkillable. If I can get a better, like, spacebar item, that's not Doctor's Remote, because I don't actually think that's better than Invincibility. Get out of here. There's so many of you guys. Get wrecked by my freaking flies, please. Did we not- I don't think we got a single damage upgrade on this run. I'm gonna check after this room. Let's- let's take a- let's take a quick look at our items. Raw liver, uh, breakfast, snack, cube of meat, PhD, wafer, blood bags. We got speed up. Oh, champion's belt. We bought champion's belt. That is the only damage up we've gotten. And we did get the screw for a little bit of tears up. But wow, this has been a very low-powered game. But we've been just steamrolling everything because of how strong we are. Yeah, you guys tried to brimstone me. I saw that shit. You don't think I know? I know. I ain't afraid of your freaking brimstone. Get out of here. Get wrecked, son. Get wrecked. What are you gonna do? Your brimstone can't hit me. I ain't afraid. All you gotta do... I, so I've learned with, with the adversary, the trick is really just, like, look at him and then move up. And then just, like, every, every about second or second and a half, just rotate wherever you are. Make sure the laser gets as many of these guys as possible. There we go. In a straight line. They like to hang out there. There we go. One of them's down at least. Possibly two. This one's down. Are you the last one? Are you the last man standing? Yeah, you are. So that's that's my tip on the adversary. If you just kind of wrote, like, it's almost like a Gertie, except he doesn't have the tell that Gertie does for when he's about to shoot, so you just gotta, like, time your rotations. Get wrecked. You wanna see Brimstone? Oh, you missed my Brimstone. Chubb killed him! Good job, little Chubby. Getting in there. Okay, so we got a dark one room. Really not a fan of the dark one. Really not a fan of any of, like, these types of enemies. And by these types, I mean, like, literally the dark one and the adversary. I don't think they're, like, the worst. Oh, tarot cards. What you got for me? That is a random teleport and will do nothing for me. Take my Book of Shadows, thank you. Why? We're just like full clearing the uh, the chest, apparently. I think we can take out these spiders pretty well. Widow's... Widow's not even... Oh, this isn't Widow. This is Wretched. Which is slightly more annoying than Widow, but... Slightly. Is the operative word there. Alright, so this sh I'm hoping is the way. Okay, I'm actually gonna... Empress here, because of the nature of this particular floor, room, I really... We're gonna take a lot of damage. Oh no, we're not, because we can... I shouldn't have Empress then. That was dumb. I forgot, we just had to get hit once and we would have been able to activate our thing. Which was bound to happen, you always, like... I get hit on that room multiple times, as evidenced by the fact that I was hit there 
twice at least. No, exactly twice actually. Well, then I triggered invincibility, so that doesn't count. Beyond that, we have 32 keys, and I think we're gonna use like literally zero of them. Okay, so there goes our invincibility. See, avoid that guy, just like circle strafe. There's some spiders we gotta deal with. He locks in pretty easily. He's not. Okay. Well, you know what? This is what I say to you. How about you get hard countered by a cube of meat in your face, you asshole? There we go. What is this? 99 bombs. We don't have any bomb synergies, do we? No. May as well check for the secret room, right? Hey, nice. Found it. More keys. Keys that are not needed. Let's blow this guy up. Maybe he'll give us something. He did not. I don't think we have a problem with this room. So I think this is Fistula and Duke of Flies, or oh, it's Fistula and Teratoma. So yeah, we'll just kind of do one of these wide stretches. And this is definitely one where Little Brimstone comes in. Like, if you ever question how if he's actually good, this is a room where he excels more than any other familiar. Cause he just pierces everything, and nothing here has a lot of health. So you just gotta drag him down. And it just like wipes the floor with most of the stuff that you're gonna see. It's really good. Chubb is also little Chubby's also pretty good there, for me completely honest. Like maybe not the strongest item, but he's he's definitely solid. And we found him. And our uh, our invincibility will be perfectly timed there. Let's go. Let's do this thing. So we're gonna go in here, laser beam him. Laser beam him. Laser beam him. Okay, now we have to actually pay attention and focus fire a bit. Which again, shouldn't be super difficult. Mainly because of the whole invincibility and take half damage from everything. And there's our first hit. Now we can go in. Now he's dead. And there you go. First chest run with Eden. Boom. Done. That was a whole lot of fun. We unlocked the mysterious paper. And we achieved Golden God by beating the chest. What? Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like. Let me know what you thought in the comments below. And I'll see you next time. Bye.